Hey there, meteorologist Eric Fisher. We have been on cruise control. Sunny and cold has been the story, and it'll be the story for the rest of today. And tonight's, well, another cold one. Back into the teens across most of the area, down to about 21 in Boston and Plymouth. Some high clouds increasing across the area, and so we'll see a little bit of a veiled starlight overnight tonight. We're trying to check out the Geminids. Peak is tomorrow night, but there'll still be quite a few of them in the sky this evening. It'll be a bit shielded from the clear skies, and those clouds will be increasing tomorrow. Also, some snow showers and flurries into Worcester. County tomorrow. Some coatings will be possible there. And then tomorrow night, we're watching to see if we can generate just enough of a bubble of clear skies in the middle of the night to really take in those geminids. It is one of the best meteor showers of the year. So fingers crossed it'll be just clear enough. Tomorrow's high temperatures ranging from the upper 20s in Worcester to the lower and middle 30s across eastern Massachusetts. Lighter winds tomorrow. Those geminids tomorrow night, over 60 meteors per hour. The moon sets just after 10 o'clock. So anytime after that is really the best time to check this one out. Should be a beautiful show. Then on Friday, we'll see increasing cloud cover, but a milder day into the 40s. On Friday night, rain starts to move into the area. It's going to bump up against this cold front, and so morning rainfall on Saturday, especially toward the south coast, will continue to get pushed offshore during the afternoon. So right now, I think the highest chance of rain will be during the morning hours before we dry out, maybe even get a little bit of afternoon sunshine. Then on Sunday, partly sunny skies, another wave of low pressure tries to move by us on Monday, and that may bring us another round of some rainfall, perhaps some wintry weather on the fringes. We'll be watching that one to see if it trends in one direction or the other. For this weekend right now, looks like we'll be well into the 40s on Saturday. Best chance of rain during the morning, drier in the afternoon and evening if you have any Saturday night holiday plans. And then on Sunday, into the lower and middle 40s with partly sunny skies. Right now, it looks like any storminess will stay just to our south on Sunday. And for the slopes, a comfortable weekend, a slight risk of a rain or snow shower on Saturday morning. Most of the weekend is dry and not as cold as it has has been recently, and that's the theme of our seven day 40s on Friday and Saturday and Sunday and Monday and Tuesday. A shot of some colder air moves back in, and it'll be seasonably cool on Wednesday in the wake of that cold shot.